Hi. Hi, everybody. Asmata here uh, with Creative Grounds DC, and I'm joined today with my son, Caleb. Caleb, my son. And her daughter. My daughter, Samra. Samra. That's right. Okay, so we are back at it again <laughs> to offer instructional videos for the Creatives Create Art Box. Um, you will see in your package, if you have Faith Ringgold and Fabiola Jean-Louis, we are going to recreate two of the pieces from um, their um, long history of, of creation, just creating beautiful work. And so the very first person that we're going to do is Faith Ringgold. Um, we're recreating an image from the book Tar Beach that's hugely popular. Um, and um, we've actually recreated the image before. And so today we're gonna do our version of it and we hope that you guys will do the same. So first, let's go over the supply list, right? So, so the, the first thing you need. thing you need is a blank canvas board. Yep, yep. a blank canvas board. And another thing is a paintbrush. A paintbrush. And another is glitter. Glitter. Who doesn't love glitter? <laughs> I mean, who doesn't? <laughs> <laughs> and blue yep. paint. Blue paint. For the scalp. Yep. And this, and patch. Yep, they're fabric squares. These are going to be like your quilts. And glue. And glue. Glue is a necessity. All right. So the first, very first thing you're going to do is you're going to paint your board blue. You're going to paint it completely blue. All right, so we're going to have Samra do that now. All right. And so while she's painting, so you're just going to take your brush. I kind of squeezed it onto the, the board here. You actually don't need very very much. You just want to be able to coat. Here you are, Sambra. Thank you. You're welcome. You want to be able to coat your, your board. And then afterward, while Sambra is painting, um, you're going to apply the glitter to the bo wet board. Very good. All right, Sambra, can I, you want to try? So the purpose of using the glitter is really to make it um, look, yeah, Sambra said to make it beautiful. Um, is to make it look like there are stars in the sky. And if you've ever read the Tar Beach um, book, you'll know that the, the, the night sky really pops off the page because of just how beautiful it is with the stars. And so, now that Sambra has colored her canvas board, can I see that? Sambra, you wanna grab the glitter? Where's the glitter? It's right there. Okay, so this is this is how it looks, right? Well, you're going to take the time to really fill in. I'm going to be with you in one second. You're going to take the time to really fill in your board so you don't have any white spaces, okay? Now, Samra is going to take a pinch of glitter and scatter it around her canvas board. Be careful, not too much. Ooh. Scatter it all around so that you can have a beautiful night sky. And then once that's done, you want to put more? You can put as much as you like. Now, the, the glitter that you have um, has holes at the very top. And so you will be able to just sprinkle it as much as you like. And you will see that it has just a bit of a shimmer yep. to it. And now you're just going to let that dry. You're going to put that aside to let it dry. And while we're waiting, you are going to use your construction sheets of paper. You have some extra construction sheets and you're going to cut out a person. A person. That's right. Do so you want to get in the camera? You want to say what you're going to do? So first you cut out a circle for the head <laughs> and maybe like a dress or a shirt or pants and shoes. Yeah, you can make shoes. You're going to use your construction paper. I want you to think in terms of shapes, right? So a circle for a head, like Sambra said, or two long rectangles for legs and arms and a square for your torso and your body. And then you're going to take that shape, put it all together on your board. And it's going to make, it's going to be like it's flying. Yes. And then when you're done, 
you you're going to take any, your you're going to take your like little fabric clip, your fabric square squares and glue it and glue it along Here, can I hold it for you can you along see along the edges yep you're going to it's just like a quilt one of the things that made um, Faith Ringgold so popular is that um, she had these beautiful quilts and she can combine that with wonderful imagery and so what we're doing here is kind of allowing the kids to make their own quilt using fabric squares blue paint a canvas board a little bit of glitter and you're gonna follow and some glue and glue glue is always important Do so you're just gonna follow it all the way around the edge now, of course, in the center here would be your flying person, but we haven't done that yet. But we're gonna do it and we're gonna come back and show you our finished product. But remember, you're just gonna continue with your fabric quilt all around the edge. And once it's done, it's gonna look just like the story, um, the image in Tar Beach. And I think you'll be happy with it. So that's the Faith Ringgold piece. Thank you, Samba, for helping us. That was You're awesome. Welcome. So remember, we're gonna show you our final product. If you have finished it and you'd love to show it to us, please make sure to have an adult take a picture, tag us at Creative Grounds DC, and we'll make sure to um, give you a thumbs up and likes, mm -hmm. okay?